Alrighty, everyone, welcome back. Thanks for stopping by. Appreciate that. Um, so today worked on uh, finishing up this room here, the elevator mechanical room for the third floor. Um, actually, this is not the third floor room. It is on the third floor, but it's for the elevator two. There's two elevators, so this is third floor is for the second elevator, and the second floor is for the first elevator. So, anyways. Um, got this second pipe in here not, not the best match right there we tried but um, I figure it wasn't extremely big of a deal um, goes in straight it would have been nice if it would have matched that angle a little bit better but um, just went with it so um, got the three-quarter in that one from yesterday was one inch um, did go ahead and throw a little uh, piece of strut up there strap those because uh, it didn't have any support from that box. Um, so went the whatever two foot back, strapped that other pipe just because it was there as well. And then, um, uh, what was I gonna say? Uh, got this strapped over here, which goes into the uh, disconnect right here, which I'll talk about more in a second. Um, and then we pulled the wire through the switch box to the junction box for the lights and then into the panel and then we also made up the feeders um, and the panel right here and then the uh, wires coming in here we made those up as well um, originally we put them on the bottom that was my bad so uh, took them back up to the top side it just kind of looked confusing I thought this was I mean obviously I should have known that this box came like this but I got kind of confused with that and uh, hooked up the load side. Actually, I should have just asked the question what these wires were for, but obviously those are probably the incoming, but you never know uh, if it was wired backwards or whatnot, if the load side was already pre-done or whatnot. But anyways, got that finally done. Um, so I got the ground, the three phase, uh, black, red, blue. And then uh, I'm gonna have to switch these tomorrow. These are in the wrong order. This transformer right here so it needs to go h3 h4 i believe so i need to take one of these wires and swap it up to this other screw right there because the incoming power is 208 and we're stepping it down to 120 so i got to go from h3 to h4 to make that happen um, i did take apart the other the other disconnect downstairs for the second floor i took this transformer off uh, which i kind of want to make a video about but i'm not sure yet um, so anyways, we hooked up, or I hooked up the extension cord, or Nick helped me, hooked up the extension cord, took all the wires off of this, and took this out of the box, and then hooked up power from uh, X1 to X2, so I had 120 coming in backwards, and then uh, stuck my meter on all these between uh, H1 and H2, it was a certain amount of voltage, H1 to H3 was a certain amount of voltage, H1 to H4 was a certain amount of voltage, and I don't think I tested in between them or whatnot, but um, one of them was 200, one was 220, one was 240, and the other one was 440. So uh, yeah, good times. Um, so I was trying to find information on it. I couldn't really find any information. So maybe if anyone's ever dealing with these down in the future, if I made a video about it, it could help someone out. But anyways, um, yep, that's what we did here today. And then also hung the, the uh, or you call them the L brackets, the uh, angle, I don't know what you call them, right? I can't think right now again, but anyways, hung the brackets for the lights and then the jack chain. So when we get the lights in, we can hang those and then wire those up to this box with some MC, I believe, or I don't think it's gonna be pipe because that two inches in the way. Anyways, that's uh, what we got going on in this room and I'll go maybe show you what's going on downstairs. Basically the same thing. We're gonna start the second floor room. Um, it's just sheet rocked instead of block. So it might make things a little more difficult, but we'll see. Might just have to hang strut or whatnot, but I can go show you that probably. And that's really all I worked on today is just finishing up this room and then uh, testing out the voltage on the uh, control transfer room. I think that's what it's called. If you look right there, uh, it says industrial control, industrial control transformer. So. Uh, testing out that for a little bit and then just cleaned up um, some other stuff so 
that's pretty much what I got going on today. We'll see if I go downstairs or not. I'll probably go downstairs because I feel like it. And then uh, I'll wrap things up. So let me just go downstairs real quick. All right, guys, so here is the second floor. You got sheetrock on one side, block on the other side, sheetrock on the other side. So we'll probably be putting a switch box right here, pipe, pipe a box in right here. Uh, the disconnect is going over here for the elevator. And then over here, the uh, panel is going over here. So basically this is the disconnect wire, which the two inch has to go across the ceiling. Um, I forgot the pathway. I think it's just gonna 90 over 90 and 90 down, if I remember correctly. Um, and then this one inch pipe right here is going to the panel, which is just gonna offset up 90 and then 90 down to the panel. And then there's another pipe behind the wall. There's a PVC pipe behind the wall, which is gonna get converted into EMT, go through a stud, go through the top of the ceiling, and then um, go back in, into this panel over here. So I uh, got it all written down on a piece of sheetrock. Hopefully that didn't get thrown away. Um, but anyways, uh, more to come on this room. We'll be doing this tomorrow. So you'll see what's going on here tomorrow, uh, whatever we get done. So. Anyways, hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video. Thanks for stopping by, as always, appreciate it. And uh, if you enjoyed the video, make sure to hit like, subscribe, I'd appreciate that. Help grow the channel, and uh, bigger and better things will be coming. Uh, check the description for anything else. Hit the notification bell for uploads and live stream notifications. Thanks guys, have an awesome rest of your day. God bless, peace out.